Hello and welcome. I'm going to do a proper intro for this because my I was going to record it on my phone, but my phone deletes the recording because, yeah, yeah, it's a dick. Uh, so, what we are doing in today's video is we have, have, well I already have, we are going to open up a Pokemon box. A box of Pokemon cards. Oh, yes. This is exciting. The reason why it's exciting is because I've liked Pokemon for a long time. You'll have seen on this content, I've done Pokemon videos quite a lot. Uh, you know, I, I remember opening Pokemon cards, not really understanding it, but opening Pokemon cards back when I was probably 10. When I was 10. I'm, I'm 19 now. That's quite scary. So, uh, yeah. When I was like 10, 11, opening Pokemon cards on the playground, and you'd go, oh, I've got this player, that, match attack, stuff like that. That was my childhood, man. Uh, so it's always nice to uh, to crack open some Pokemon cards. and It's a big trend on YouTube right now. It's not quite as in its peak as it was, but I'm not the type to get on trends when they're, when they're at the top. I'm Just after they've peaked, I like to get on a trend and make my video. That's what I did with Fortnite, and it, it didn't do as well as I hoped it would. It don't... Because... I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a football YouTube channel. But yeah, on the second channel, I kind of do whatever the hell I like. And a lot of that has been Pokemon. And this is going to be Pokemon as well. So yeah, we're going to open up this box. This box right here. And uh, we're going to see exactly what we get. Right, here we go. So, we'll open it up. And now, let's get involved. So, we have... The rules. But that's not what we're here for. We're here for those. Those cards, in fact. Now, if we very carefully... Cards. And above India, we'll get to opening them. So I'm not an expert at opening Pokemon card packs. I'm just going to try and not... Rip them. That wasn't the cleanest of opens, I, I have a horrible feeling. Wingle on the front, okay, so I believe it's the classic, we'll put the code card over there, uh, as I might want to do something with that, that might be another video. Uh, we go one, two, three, and four, and here we go, okay, so grass energy, to, oh, so grass energy to start us off, we've got a beware, we all like a bit of beware. Uh, we have Skylar, okay, we've got Luxio, okay, we've got Wingo, okay, Phantom, Bronzor, Toxel, Applin, I think I see a hollow. the top there, or no, that might just be dust, Applin, Okay, so that is a reverse hollow Litwick. Okay, and an Elder Goss. That, that's quite a nice card. So, actually, two very nice cards here. Two very nice cards in our first pack. I'll take that. We'll put them over here. Uh, we'll put them over here, in fact. So they are off camera for now. And then uh, try and make a neater pile of, of the uh, slightly less exciting cards. Okay, pack number two. Let's try and make it a bit more graceful than pack number one, shall we? Uh, so doing it on camera is the, uh, the fiddly bit. There we go. There we go. It's a bit more clean. Keeps the front uh, on the pack intact, which is the most important thing. Put that code card over there. And then go one, two, three, and four. And we start off with a dark energy, I believe that is. Mascarin, yeah. Do a blade. Capture Energy, Hatena, Arcuda, Galarian Meowth, 
bit of Surskit, a Magikarp, we have a, it's not a hollow, but it's, it's, it's a, it's a, it's a Surskit, and we've got something big at the back, we have Malamar, okay, that's a nice card, we'll have a look at the centering, by the way, because, uh, me being me, I am actually quite interested. Uh, centric. It's a bit big at the bottom, I notice. Uh, like the, on the, on the, on the right hand side, it, it's kind of lacking. It's not a perfectly centered card, I don't think, but that's not the end of the world. Malmar It corrupt tomorrow. So I've just realised actually my phone has just corrupted and I don't have any face cam for this. But that's not the end of the world. You, my hands very very handy uh, in this case for telling stories. I speak a lot with my hands as well, so that's not the end of the world. Uh, I'm going to sleeve up my Pokemon. So there's the Sir Skit. Might as well do this now because I have no time limit. Which I would have had otherwise. Let's go. Malamar. I mean, we'll have a look at the. Con we'll analyse the condition in a bit. I don't think the centering's perfect, which is a, which is a big thing for quality of Pokemon cards. Badum! Nice! Okay! Let's tidy up this one. Pack number three. Pack number three. Uh, I'm hoping for a bit of a dub. Maybe. Possibly. You never know. Well, there's a Darumaka. I can clearly see. He's upside down right now. Oh, I'm not as good as everyone else is. Right, okay, so it's four off the back. One, two, three, and four. Oh, here we go. Water energy. I should start predicting the energies a bit more. We have a Dracloak here. We have a, a Bronzong. We have Milo. Big boy Milo. There's our Darumaka. Bunnelby. That's a nice, that's a nice one. That's a nice card. Vulpix. All oh, those Gen 1ers out there will, will be a fan of that. Phantom. It's a cool Pokemon. It's a cool Pokemon. There's our Galarian Farfetch'd. Very nice, very nice. Ooh, okay, that's a that is a hollow. You can see the shine on it down at the bottom there. It's a reverse hollow, in fact, of course. That's very nice. And the last card. Ooh, okay, that is a hollow dragapult. A hollow dragapult. You can see nice and rainbowy there. If I get the the good light on it, you can see. Oh, it's quite nice. See, I'm I'm certainly no professional. Uh, I've not got any backlighting. What, what I what I what I can do is uh, uh hold on. This is this is very basic. I can light it up, but I I need to adjust my light. Oh, brilliant. 
There we go. That should be good for, for showing it off. Yeah, okay, nice little shiny Dragapult. Nice little hollow Dragapult. So, let's get these two sleeved up. They've not got Dragon then, because he's a, he's a psychic. So far, so good to be fair. I've got quite a good card in each of them, I feel. I'm not an expert. But I'm happy. I'm satisfied. reach halfway with pack number four. Right. There is a meditate on the front. It would help if I opened them the right way up, wouldn't it? <laughs> that is Right, so, I will keep the code card for myself because I might want to do some BGC online for a video, as I, as I keep saying. And then if I move my microphone just a bit, we'll go one, two, three, and four. Right, so, steel energy, I believe that is. Have a bit of charge above. Okay, okay. A bit of shuckle. Everyone loves a bit of shuckle. We've got Dan! 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 Bit of an Alan Partridge reference there. Uh, we have Meditite, who we knew we had. Milkery. Oh, a bit of Growlithe. Again, everyone loves a bit of Growlithe. Impidimp. It's not a not a hollow. We got the bunnelby again. Ooh, a reverse hollow bronzong. I quite like bronzong as a Pokemon. It was a absolute. It can be an absolute pest in Gen Four. I remember it being quite annoying. Uh, and Runarigas. Runarigas is 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 not. Fantastic as a pull. It's not a hollow or anything, but Bronzong. Steady that. Bronzong is. Let's put it in the right way. There we go. In a sleeve, so we can we can manhandle it a bit more now. Uh, yeah. Let it focus. Come on, come on! Don't focus on, don't focus on my mat. Focus on the bron, on the bronzong. Yeah. Do I have to? I have to do the makeup thing. They do. Yeah. Look, it's it's a nice little uh, reverse hollow. It's not the shiniest of shiny cards. Yeah. A decent pulp. I quite like that. Right. Pack, give it a wiggle. I am opening it from the top, that's nice. Uh, I'm, I'm having some problems with this one. Give me a sec. There we go. Right. Okay, so we want to do that and then open her up. All the way. Uh, 
Whoa, that's gone everywhere. Right. One, two, three, and four. Let's see what we've got. Okay. Psychic energy. A bit of shuckle. Everyone likes shuckle. Keep it nice and together, George. Bit of Luxio. We like Luxio. A bit of Durant. We like Durant. A bit of Squovit. Mr. Mime. Galarian Mr. Mime, I should say. Caterpie. Bob Roach. Aracuda. A bit of a bronzor to go with our bronzong. And Sigilith. Is this a. Yeah, that's a hollow. The bronzor's a hollow, so we've got. Well, a reverse hollow, even, I should say. So we've actually got. The pack looks not quite what it was, but. If we have a look at this guy, we have a nice little partnership here. Let's have a look at this under the camera. Oh, hell yeah. Lovely stuff. Right. Pack number six, I believe this is. Would it be wiser if I if I attacked it from this angle? Maybe. Maybe. That could be clever. Right. I'll open the pack. As you can see, nice and open. Uh One, two, three, and four. And here we go. It's a fire energy. The, the, the energy, of course, of the Charizard. He's not in this set, but I'm just saying. Twin energy? Okay. Oh, let me just adjust my hands. Phalanx. Nice. Musquerane. Love it. Phantom. Creepy. Galarian Farfetch'd. Honage. Time Pole. Ooh. Aegis Slash Reverse Hollow is a nice card. And an Unpheasant. Oh, all those big cards. We, we opened them nice and early at the start. It's not really what you want for a video. But it's another great Steel type to our collection. Just uh, sleeve him up here. And there we go. Eggslash. Very cool Pokemon. I, 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 I shiny hunted for one over the summer and was successful, which is very nice. Right. Pack number seven. The penultimate one. Say so what? On the last pack, I will give you. I, I will. I will release the code card. Okay. I feel like there's a little nick on the penultimate one, which is usually a good one. Fighting energy. Are we coming out fighting late on here? Palisand. Oliana. The mad professor. The twin energy. It's a little stuffle. That's a very nice card. Lottad. Growlith. Roly Coley. I like the artwork. Meditite. Okay. It's a Galarian Mr. Rhyme. Let's get that. The light's not quite working in my favour here. Let me get the angle. There you go. You can see. Nice little shiny card. Ah, 
and a bomber snow. Okay, so only one reverse hollow so far in this pack. Well, in that pack. Better over there. Right. Last pack. So you get the code from this, so be ready to go and put it in if you are watching this. But you never know, you could be the person who gets it. Right, so your code is that. There we go. So I'll, I'll put that to one side, actually. One, two, three, and four. Here we go. Electric energy. Energy of Pikachu. Come on. The mascot. We get an electrode. The tool scrapper. A cursed shovel. A cursed shovel. I just gotta make sure I get it on camera. A Volpix. A coughing. I do like the dark card. But they do always make me think. <gasps> oh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a reverse hollow, but it's not. It's just a card design. Let me just move my mic because I'm kind of brushing up against it. I don't want to ruin the audio quality. Shinx. Very nice. Galarian Yamask. Applin, come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. It's not a hollow, I don't. Reverse hollow, I don't think. No, it is. It is. It is. It is. It is. And Magmortar, the last Pokemon we get from the box. Okay. So, there we go. Not the worst. Collection of Pokemon? Possibly you could make a claim that it's not the best. Let's get our... Reverse... Hollows, hollows and, and such out. Onto the desk. Right, and then we've got the other three here. Okay, so that's not all in all, not too bad. We didn't get any duplicate hollows, which is nice, and we got. Uh... Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll swap those around so it's going to be a tiny bit messy, but that's okay. And you can see Malamar and Eldegoss were probably our best two poles. So there we have it. Uh, Pretty good, pretty good. Uh, I've not yet looked up all the uh, all the values and stuff like that. Uh, there's no there's no massive dubs. I know, you know, some of the the full arts. I think we only got one full art, and that was the uh, the the Malamar. I suppose no, no. The the Elder Goss is a full art as well. The V cards. Uh, these two. Let me just uh, get them up there. Can't really see them because the light reflects off them. Come on. No, that's not going to work. Let's... Oh, back here. Yeah, you can kind of see him back here. You can kind of see him back here. Those two... I mean, you will have seen them in the video. They were probably our best two. Uh, so, yeah. It's not too bad, all in all. I'll, I'm, I'll happily take that. Uh, as far as uh, as these stu as, as this goes, I, I, I'm fairly happy. I'm fairly happy. It's not perfect, but it's it's also not an L, which was the most important thing. It's not an L. That's what matters. So that is it for for this video. Uh, I might do another one of these if this does well, but I also might not because it was a whole lot of effort to to record. And it didn't come out exactly as good as I would have hoped it would. For example, like I didn't have my my face reactions in the in the video. Uh, but maybe it's something somewhere down that down the future when I might be able to solve those issues uh, it'll be all better anyway uh, th this will be a change up from the from the content I've recently been posting on this channel I've been putting VODs up so this is also my VOD channel as well for, for whenever I stream on Twitch that stream will be available on this channel 
it's mostly football manager stuff so if that interests you then uh, then stick around thank you very much for watching i've been ruse like subscribe and cheerio